What is happening, y'all? Welcome back, and we are all Mystic Knighted out. So I have a, a shield that is just something we picked up here, I think, actually. Blue Kite Shield. Uh, it's made for Mystic Knights, so it'll it'll fit the mark. Uh, we're going to be working with Dragon's Dog with a sword still, because I don't have a mace. Um, beyond that, I got up uh, a couple levels here. I'm up to, to rank level 3. That gave me access to a couple of the basic moves. I still have Full Moon Slash from Assassin. I still have Antler Toss. And we have this thing called Sky Rapture. Pretty good for stabbing harpies out of the sky. Uh, so, as for our counters, we're going to be going Ice and Holy, and then something called Demon Spite. So these are pretty cool. You essentially put it on your shield, and then you block at the last second, and it'll do a... If you execute a perfect block, it's kind of like, you know, the same response as if you were to get a parry. You'll essentially blast the element off your shield. So if it's lightning, lightning bolts will come down. If it's ice, it's like a big deluge of ice that explodes out of stuff and freezes it. If it's holy, little holy stuff shoots out. I also picked up something called Demon Spite, and I've read about this. It's a little bit trickier. Essentially, I need to block with this for a while, and a gauge will build up, and then I execute it again, and it'll do that and do a big old demon-y explosion. So we'll see how that works. Um... I also went ahead and I picked up um, new augments. I decided that if I'm going to be switching midway, I wanted to have the right augments for this. So one of the things I was able to do was essentially pick up augments from other classes via cheat engine. So we got clout from warrior. I would have had to level warrior all the way up. And then we got the casting ones that I needed. So buffs my magic, makes enchantments last longer. Uh, make spells cast faster, and then uh, we picked up this. This just allows perfect blocks to be a little bit easier. Not really needed, but whatever. I figured since I'm learning a class, it would be good. Um, so I, it still spent all of my, my DCP to do this. So as you can see, I only have 1,100, uh, and that's basically from fighting the uh, the enemies back at the capital. I went there and just whacked on them for a bit, had the pawns help kill them was able to get up to to rank three and that's what i needed for uh the core skill i rank three we got what is it called this thing reflect and this is what lets us uh fire back our shield at people so with that we're good to go i've also uh upgraded some pawns as you can see we now have mound shroud and orion uh to give a quick look at them so this one has ingle frigger and omestian and then Anodyne, Spell Screen, and Holy Affinity. So very similar to our last one, except instead of Lightning, it has a higher tier of Ingle, and it has uh, the Firewall. And then our second one has Lightning, Fire, Miasma, and then Ice, Meteors, and Lassitude. So two different status type abilities. I think that'll work pretty well. Um, you know, we haven't, I haven't had a chance to, to play with these ones yet. I just picked them up a little bit ago. Used up most of my Rift Crystals for that. And this is where we came from. We want to go through the other door. I'd actually started going through this, and then I was like, actually, you know what? Let me go level up somewhere else. So, thankfully, I haven't fought anything memorable yet. It was just a couple undead and a banshee. Um, I don't think we fought a banshee before, but that'll probably respawn, so. Here we go. Fortress of Remembrance. All right, no Banshee. Yeah, usually there's some Undead and a Banshee right here. It doesn't look like they're going to be coming along. I grabbed those. And then right when I was about to go, like, deeper, I was like, actually, you know what? I need to need to back out. Basically, I started fighting my way through. Um, and then I realized that I couldn't do shield counters because I didn't have that reflect skill. And so then I went back, fought through the guards for, for a hot minute to get the skills I needed. Um, so we can go this way, but the marker wants us to go here. So we're going to be going into this way first. Uh, and then we'll head down that other way. Oh, she killed it. I didn't even get to do my counter thing. So far, I can I can do it pretty easily against humans, but I'm not very good at executing it against monsters. There we go. Boom! Ice counter. Ice counter. Ooh. 
Yeah, level four. That's what I'm talking about. Brought us victory. That's all. <laughs> Barely worth the away. effort. You need but consult. There's a tangled knot of paths inside. Oh, okay, so I gotta go below where I'm at. Still missing a lot of the big skills. I know, uh, something was it like Grand Holy Cannon or something, or Grand Cannon, I think it's called. And then you upgrade it with the enchantments you use or something like that, but I don't have that yet. I don't know, that's one of the, the big things. And then there's a enchant you can get later on called, uh,. Abyssal Anguish, which my understanding is it like upgrades your weapon with a multi-hit buff. So like when you swing, it's like bang, 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 bang. Like it will hit stuff uh, multiple times every time you swing. Supposedly it's actually even good for climbing on monsters because you get, you get good hits while using it. fight thing out. This one I just got, so I haven't seen how this works exactly. Right, did I do any damage to him? I don't think I did. I think I need to build it up more. I think I tried using it. Oh my god, dude. I haven't even used my thing yet. All I'm gonna say is whenever this, this thing goes off, it better be the fattest explosion I have ever seen, because it sure felt like <laughs> that. Blocking one hit and trying to use it, it did absolutely nothing. So it might be like, this just, you know, it's... Dragon Ball Z rules. It takes three episodes to charge up. I mean, not that long, but if it did, I would drop this skill immediately. But I'm worried that this thing is going to fall off my shield before I even have a chance to use it, because we went that whole fight without executing it. You know, like, uh, like that's the way I got to go. That's for progress. Yeah, and it's fallen off. Maybe it's it'll be better against something that's big. Fight some big boys with it. That's where I came from initially. Let's go check this way. This attitude. Oh, come on, what? Guys, help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. Get it off me. That's dope. So I don't know. I wonder if I can bait them out in any way. 
Because I've been... I mean, I haven't been... Super good about about hitting chests, but you know, anytime I see a chest now that's kind of like off by itself, I'm like, eh. Actually, well, I don't even know why I'm bothering swinging. Weapon and gear, dude. I don't want to go get this stuff now. Is it worth going all the way out though and using one of my lift stones? I don't know. I think it'd be good to do that, because maybe it's some better Mystic Knight stuff, like a new uh, new weapon, another piece of armor, something like that. Platinum? Mm. Yeah, this is going to be good for upgrading stuff. Zombie dragon? It is, dude. I haven't fought one of these things in ages. Attack. Holy counter! Okay, that thing just booted me. I did not care that I used the whole. Oh my god! Oh my god! My health. Maybe I. Maybe I don't belong here. Maybe this is a terrible idea. Yeah, sky rapture that heart. Let me. Let me put on this demon spite thing. Oh my god. Bro. Shroud, come on. I need you doing stuff here. Oh, there we go. That means doing some work. To sell that thing. Do anything? I can't tell if Demon Spite is doing anything for me. It doesn't feel like it is. And there was some other thing I picked up, which I didn't bother getting, but it was called, uh. Well, I, I got it, but I haven't put it on, but it's like Holy Wall. I've been looking up these abilities as I have them for purchase and that one apparently like it makes you basically create like a giant shield wall in front of your entire party with it so like it's more like an MMO thing almost but that might be useful since I got two casters because my understanding is you get it and I mean literally you just block with it but it's good for protecting your casters while they do caster stuff so that, that that might be a good a good pick for me Go for the holy oh god no he's murdering everybody i think the holy counter will work out better here than anything else i'm using I 
seems to work pretty well. Everybody get it. Be the test now. There's my music drop. I like dun 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 I think it's I think anything that's a dragon you can get your uh you can get dragon forge from. Some miasma. I mean I have I am having to like burn through my curatives, but we're we're getting it. But we're halfway dead now. Get him on fire. Big undead dragon leap to fire. It's like RPG 101. So if I was an assassin, man, this fight would have been over. I would have climbed on this thing's heart and just gone to town with Dire Gouge. jumped into its hand. Two bars left. If I I make her a strider and then I give her something the, the rusted weapons that what's his face we're using. Apparently they're like when they're all the way leveled up, they have like a really, really high chance of poisoning a target. So what a lot of people do is they they take a strider, they give it some really badass daggers, but then they give it like a rusted bow. And so when it's climbing on stuff, it'll really mess it up. But it'll use rusted daggers and like uh, downpour volley, <clears throat> and just do a ton of uh, it'll do a ton of, of it's like AOE poison, and it'll just really mess something up. I don't know, maybe. I mean, I changed my guy around. Maybe change uh, change my pawn around as well. Because all the time spent as as Ranger, like it won't hurt damn dude, that bull is doing some work to this thing. The Ranger has I think higher higher uh, stamina gain, so that'll help for any climbing that she does. I really wanna like lure this thing out into the open.
need like one good set of fireballs on. Oh, here we go. This is it. You're dead. You're dead. You're going down. Damn. Big ass thing, dude. Ghost dragon. Hey, yeah, dig a dragon forge, dope. Am I alone in wishing to be out of this place? Only problem is I'm not gonna find anything that's gonna be stronger than this with that. With that being dragon forged, didn't dragon forge my shield though. That? Just the helm. I mean, the helm is good though. That that'll make this uh, on par with some of the other stuff I had. Still, I need to level up more. I mean, God, how many how many restoratives did I blow through for that fight? An unhealthy amount. That's how many. Oh, that's where we found the chest. Where did we go to leave this place? I think we gotta... I don't remember where there was even a door that required a void key. I'm assuming we gotta work our way backwards. But I kinda wanna go back up to the surface, because... Since I got vocation rank 4, uh, I'd rather, uh... rather pick up some new skills. And I gotta drop this demon spite thing off. The thing is ass. I don't know. Like I want. I mean, it sounds really cool, you know. Absorb damage and build up to do a a fat counterattack. But from what we've seen so far, it does not seem to work well. Oh God, no. Well, that was perhaps the most disappointing death I have ever gotten. Very well. I'm on my way. Actually, you know what? Do I wanna... No, yeah, let's... let's I think it's this way. We'll continue on. I know there's a, a big guy up ahead. And I'd already restored that. I have been badly cursed. I'm a big guy. There should be a big guy, like, right around here somewhere. So I know on the, the episode where I, like, started going out and I didn't have an encounter, I, like, went this way originally. And I was like, no, I don't want to go this way. I want to go follow the, the thing. There we go. There's the big guy. And then this was a... I don't want to go there yet. That's not where the marker tells me to go. Right, if there was ever a time to get a feel for whether or not this thing works, it's now. I got a big-ass dude. Oh god. Alright, I need to... I'm gonna do my thing, I'm gonna block all those attacks with it, and then I'm gonna unleash a big demon counter. Turn around and hit me, big boy. damage to him. I can't I can't even like block.
Like, I'm trying to get off a perfect block. It's not, it doesn't matter. bro back here shit I've gone through all of my things every single one of those heals I have burned through Jesus that's insane Guys, cast this. Cast this. He's, he's doing something big. This looks like it's going to hurt a lot. Oh, God, no. I'm going to die. I'm so dead. Wow. Dude, help me down. Really, Mount Shroud? That's what you, you're just going to stand there and you're going to stare at me. Oh, wow, this dude one shots me. Somebody's on the fast track to getting her ass replaced. to go exactly is it just below below where this guy's at because I'm gonna head back to base and get rid of this abyssal anguish thing that I have which doesn't doesn't seem like it does anything We're not abyssal anguish uh, demon spike we go with some armor level ones dope So that's where, that's where the uh, marker wants me to go, that way. I get over to there. I think that's where What's-Her-Face was jumping over to. Since they're here, I can open that chest. I'm, just, I'm scared of opening any chests, unless my party is around. into that place up higher. how to get into there then. Cause 
that's... It's gotta be like a, I come up from underneath and get this thing open. Yeah, I don't think we can do that right now. And then so instead we can proceed that way. Alright, um... But there's that, that middle room that I skipped too. I kinda wanna explore that middle room and see where that goes. Either way, I'm not running all the way back. That's, that's, a, that's a long run. I'll pop one of these. Um, so I'm going to pick up some new skills, hopefully figure out what I want to run with here, and then we'll jump back in for more Bitter Black in the next episode.